Warrior. I can't play Warrior, there's no way. I will not rest until the Naru is whole once again. Um, Raider. You know what? I kind of want Raider. It feels like you get offered a lot of clerics. Actually good. Yeah, that was a good pack. Fun to see cards that aren't uh, non-hollow rares, right? That's what it's about sometimes. Uh, I got two Pidgeots now, though. Maybe I'll build a Pidgeot deck. And I will whoop Drenz's ass with it. Uh, let's take the Raider. Uh, Courier's okay. Uh, it's a good Priest card, right? And then a, range, a Rager could be good. Uh, if we had taken the Cleric, it's a little easier to get like a 5-3 on Curve. Which is still possible. Um, I think if you have a Vile Fiend, it's really nice to have a Rager sometimes. Coin a Vile Fiend into another Vile Fiend into a 3-mana 5-5. Five five. But I don't know if we'll get the cards necessary. This is a good one with uh, a Rager. We just passed, but I like Orc and I hate these cards, so. Take a bad 2 over a bad 4. I mean, they're not. Uh, neither cards are bad. They're just boring and not good. Uh, Maze Guide's good, though. I do like Glacial Shard, but let's take a Maze Guide here. Uh, there's Dragon Synergy. We didn't have any Dragon Synergy in the last deck, so maybe we'll get a buttload this time. That Fool is so good. Um, but I think you just gotta take the Vile Fiends when you get them. Go first, get a Vile Fiend down early, win the game. Beetle or Pyro? I think I'm a Beetle man. I don't like Pyro. I like gaining some life. Um, these are both good. Resurrect isn't great. Let's take the uh, Humunculus. We'll take a class card here. And a Scorpid is a good card. Wow. <laughs> the problem with Lyra is one, it's not very good. She's not very good. Uh, two, I have no spells. Not a single flippin' spell. And I'm probably not gonna get any because it's wretched spellless meta. Muro? Muro's the pick if you want to win. I actually think Muro's fun too. And we did say we were gonna try to get some dragon synergy. Ain't nothing wrong with that, right? Uh, Herring's much better than that card. Oh, look. Could have had the, uh, the Lyra synergy. Uh, I actually think Unsleeping Soul can be a kind of an interesting card. Your opponent freezes your guy, you unfreeze it. Um, maybe we get the 4 mana 4 7. Sometimes you're just making a 4 mana 3 5, and that might be better than both of these as well. I'm gonna take it. Uh, Elixir's. I think Elixir's okay. Honestly, I'd rather have um, Apotheosis, and I would rather have that other one that makes it so your guy can't be targeted. But I don't really need my 40th minion, so let's take a buff spell. It's at least sort of interesting, right? Honestly, I'm not convinced Nova's better than Maze Guide, but let's take a, a Nova, diversify what our deck can do a little bit, respond to some different situations. Shard and Staff, mm, I don't know. I think they're probably close. Let's take a Glacial Shard, maybe. Let's take a Treasure Staff. I'm not sure it's close. Uh, Smite, if I take in the Lyra, you could probably force the Smite over the Sin Runner, but I think Sin Runner's just too good here. Uh, wow, unfortunate. Um, not sure which one's better, but I I'm gonna take Identity Theft because it can give us two cards. Didn't we, uh, we got this guy, right? It's kinda cool. Nice seven, decent six, uh, three six, three zero six. Uh, Hogsteed's not bad either. One, two, three, four, five. Don't really need a two. Take the Bone Chewer, maybe. Taking another Courier over the, uh, Worm. Deck is getting a little heavy and we still have ten picks. Two Couriers and, uh, Identity Theft's pretty cool. Staff has the numbers. I like the win rate. What's Staff? I got so excited. I was like, well, we got our Renew back. Uh, two one-mana pre-spells must be Renew, right? Treasure Staff, oh. Yeah, Treasure Staff's a good card. Just think, like, being able to, like, play your one on one and start your Infuse kind of train can be good. Just buffing your Vile Fiend, even one health, can be pretty impactful. Like, these type of cards take the buff well. Tar Creeper I draft a lot. Take that. Hey, speaking of which, uh, we have the Corruptor, but I just don't even think it's a great payoff even when you're doing dragon things. Let's go Tar Creeper here. And I despise Ravisaur Runt. I've always hated that card. Um, I would probably take it over a Violet Spell Sword, but I'm happy we don't have to. Not a great card here again. Still would prefer both the other buffs, but I still want to run either of those cards. Ay, ay, ay. Best card's Partner in Crime, right? 
The scale paint's good. I want Stone Hill so I can get Skeletal Dragon, and that's really the only reason I'm taking it. Hey, immediately rewarded. We, you, you think, oh, we could have had two partners in crime. Not a chance. We wouldn't have got this one offered if we didn't uh, pass the first one. Running a Shervara seems okay over garbage. Having one clean scene seems okay. Don't hate that. Very different deck than the last deck we just played. I don't know which card's better. I think they're close. Um, I'm going to take the Dragon card because we... Didn't we have some minimal reason to do that? No, well, last pick, uh, Draconid Operative. I like this one better than the Scribe in general, but I think they're both good. And probably an Accuser. Destroy a minion after you play a card copied from your opponent. It was good in our deck yesterday, but we had, I think, three or four ways to steal cards. This deck only has one-ish. Whereas Accuser is just a good card, right? It's playing green games in front of a thousand people. It sounds like somebody made the right life choice. Are you talking to me? Uh, well, we got raided today, but I guess getting the opportunity to be raided was nice. Um, courtesy of Asmodai and Taze. So without, you know, those type of champions, we might not have a thousand viewers, right? Scribe might be better because of Infuse. Yeah, last pick, it's tough to say because we had no Infuse. Or one Infuse card, maybe. But yeah, having Infuse is definitely good. To even be on Asmo's radar is an honor. I've mentioned this in the past about my um, my interactions and my history with Asmodai. Been a humongous streamer for years and years. Um, I remember when I was just my first year of streaming, my first like six months of streaming. I was, you know, I went from five viewers to ten to twenty to thirty to 40, to 50, right? And I'm like, fuck, man, like, this is unbelievable. 50 viewers a night kind of thing. I already knew who Asma was and Crip, you know, uh, Amaz, Hafu, like some of these humongous streamers, Tice. And uh, I, I took a week vacation with a gal I was dating. She, I didn't want to take a vacation, but she's like, Hang on, we gotta go somewhere. I'm like, okay, fine. And I went to, to Portland from LA we spent like you know five or six days in Portland maybe seven days or something and I went to a video game kind of arcade bar they had like a little land set up where people were playing like counter-strike and maybe a couple machines and they had a big TV back behind the bar and they had Asmo on the bar and I was so stoked I was like wow look at that this Scandinavian young man playing Hearthstone in a bar in Portland with some bozos playing Counter-Strike on the screen, on the bar. And I said to the lady, I'm like, wow, isn't that incredible? We got Asmo on the TV and she said, who's that? I was like, well, he does kind of what I'm trying to do. And she's like, well, that's dumb. I'm like, oh, great. It's going to be a long trip. <laughs> anyway, we didn't date much longer after that. Uh, thank you to another raid uh, downloader. Thank you very much to the 19th person. I missed the name. If it was you, dear chatter, thank you. Yeah. Betting on 10 to 12, let's go. Zyrella. I think this deck is worse than the last one. Um, what did I have in the, in the Warlock deck? This deck is... I don't know. I don't think it's a bad deck. I think 6 or 7 is in the, is in the realm of possibility. 8 maybe? 6 to 8 I would probably be betting. Uh, I'd have to see the odds between 4 to 6 and 7 to 9, if that's what we're throwing up there. And I would, um, I would make a strategic bet, whichever one was paying me better odds, probably. It looks like you're getting much better odds on 4 to 6, so I would probably put my money there. Which now I'm gonna screw up the betting with my statement now, but, you know, that's fine because making that statement, the real money, the real money bet may fall. <laughs> I just, just like skyrocketed four to six. The real money bet, now that you guys have made a mistake, is probably zero to three. That's the real key. You face a Denathrius, you go second three straight games, your opponent scrap imps you or plays that, um, you know, maybe they go one drop, two drop, three drop. You might just be iced out. And now, <laughs> now the, Payoffs go in a different direction. 
I love that story. Yeah, I don't know. It's it's a story. I just, I remember how impactful it was. And I was already grinding at that time, 10, 11 hours a day, maybe. I would do two streams. I would, I would, you know what? Can I tell you the truth? I've told this before and I, I don't even really want to admit it. But I would, um, so I was dating the gal and she was, she was not the best fit, right? I'm not here to, you know, really like disparage her or anything, but she wasn't like nice or anything. It wasn't a, like a good relationship, especially because she didn't really support, you know, what I was trying to do. Which whatever, if you don't, if you don't want it, you just break up with somebody or you support them, right? Like you got like a couple options, but she was kind of like, kind of um, detrimental in a lot of ways. But I used to stream whatever, like nine or whatever time we stream now, till like four or five in the morning. And then she used to be like texting me and calling me all the time. And uh, like if I didn't pick up, she would get like really mad. And um, I remember I used to go to bed at like five or six or seven in the morning and she'd get to work at like eight or nine and start like bugging me all day. <laughs> so I would set an alarm for like, I, I would like fall asleep at six or seven. I'd set an alarm for like nine or 10 and then I'd set like another one for like 11 or 12 and I just wake up and like text her back and then go back to bed. <laughs> like, oh yeah. Oh, no, no, no kidding. I'd write like one word <laughs> and then go back to bed. And then I'd start streaming again at like noon. I'd do like noon to four or five or something like that. It's actually not bad this turn. I suppose neither is this though on this board, huh? I thought I would get like five cards. The loss of REM sleep. That sounds miserable. <laughs> it wasn't the best relationship I've ever been in. But it Long term, we dated for a while, a little over a year. That was, that was the, I haven't really dated a lot of women for a long time. Um, it might have been the worst long term relationship, like over like like a month or two, three months. I dated some people for a shorter period of time that were less uh, agreeable. Hey, wrong staff. Thanks so much for the uh, 15 months. That's pretty sick. That's good. I play my own. It's not really great. Um, yeah, I just, I don't, I don't know. Maybe I should be trading. Maybe he'll trade for us so we don't get more value. Who's hit the board first? Mine or his? I already forgot. It's actually kind of insane if mine hit the board first and he just plays like an eight drop or something. You can tell it's just 1,000 of your closest friends in here <laughs> on that story. Is hit the board first? Okay, thank you. It's important to know because then I might hit a 1-1. You might be like looking up online trying to find a reddit post that explains the, the sequencing. <laughs> it's like, oh fuck. The truth is in here. Well... What if I just hit like this and just wait it out, right? It's a little hit on here. Big whoop. I don't care. I care a little bit. I'm also starting to think our deck's not very good. We don't have a death. We don't have a the light that burns. Got an imprisoned idiot though. You get the goods. I'll stand watch. So I just sit and hope I'm you not dead. Goods, I'll stand watch. Four, five, six, pushes four, puts us two, six. I have no taunts. What when people put Spike Rich Steed on a Violet Worm? Has that happened a lot? I haven't seen that yet. I don't think. I think I did see somebody conjure their worm once against me, I believe. I might have dreamt that. Oh yeah, whatever I bet on. Bet the polar opposite, and you'll be a millionaire within a year. God damn, millionaire. Fart points? Wow, that sounds great. Channel points. That's even better. I think I saw that. Like, I was dead, and then I won. <laughs> and we have six remaining Pokemon packs. We did okay in that last one. Trainer gallery and a V card? Wow. Neato. 
need a Ah oh, shit. Oh, that's so good to get a taunt. Alright, let's do Someone's this. Coming. Someone's coming. Hit the three two, duh. And then do I wanna shoot? I think I just wanna get this stuff down. I'm a little terrified of um direct damage. Maybe one of these he, like gets there somehow. Heal the two three. I don't think it's super valuable. We open nine. Uh, I'm not doing all of them. Currently, we have ten. Ten. Because what if I need to open those others some other time? Maybe in the leisure of my own apartment in my underwear. <laughs> we open all nine. <laughs> Not bad, I thought you said 15. Must have misheard. <laughs> no, I, I, it was buy two, get one free. So I got two and they gave me one free and each one had five packs in it. Put that on your OnlyFans, thank you. OnlyFans must be created. I like that part. Uh, what do we want? Something I can play with the accuser. What did I get? Something I can't play with the accuser. Well, go figure. Uh, let's bump here. Let's push here. And that's nine. Um, I guess I still have lethal in theory. Five, nine, ten. I'm just scared of like the top deck Alexstrasza, you know? You've played Overwatch 2? I've been playing Overwatch 2. I get so mad. I've only played for like two days. The game makes me so angry. I don't like first person shooters because I feel like I, I feel like every first person shooter I've ever played and I'm not good at them, right? Clearly. I'm old and my aim's not good and I don't play enough and I get so frustrated with them. I feel like every game plays the exact same way. I'm sitting there shooting someone, probably missing a lot, but feel like I'm hitting them non-stop. And then I always die when they're at like one HP. And then they like on every game's got like you fully heal and you come back and it's like the same sequence of events. And then like I get back into the fight. That's 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 option one. And option two is I get back into the fight and I instantaneously die. And I have to just spend all the time dying and then running back to the fight and then alternating between shooting people and missing. The whole time, probably. And then, you know, or hitting them and getting them very low and then being the one that dies. We're, we're both doing the same thing, I'm sure. Anyway, that's my... That's my Overwatch. But it's fun, it's a cool game. It's just, it's so fast. Like, these games are just, just like, they're too fast. You know what I mean? Do I get two? I get two, Nito. It's made for Zoomers? Yeah, yeah. And I'm sure, like... But even even when I was a kid, and I was a quote-unquote Zoomer, I still felt like games sort of felt that way. He's gonna do what here? An owl. I'm hoping he abyssals. Okay, thank you. I thought he was abyssaling. Um, like, un I played Unreal Tournament a little bit as a kid. Like, I didn't play a ton. Uh, Halo uh, with my friends. I, uh, I didn't play a ton, but like we played sometimes. It always feels like the same thing. And this is I, like, I'm not saying just Overwatch. All the games feel the same way. I'm shooting people. They live with one HP and they fully heal and I die. And then I'm, I spend all time running and then somebody snipes me or whatever. Okay. Uh, and I'm clear, I'm not saying the games suck. They're really cool. They're really fun. I'm saying I know I suck. And that's why I don't like them <laughs> that much. Get motion sick if I play certain first person games. I'm running some Halo custom games. You're welcome to join. I don't even know how to play Halo. Red was voted most unlikely to become an esports athlete in high school. When I was in high school, there was no such thing as the internet. But what I found, because I, I, I hadn't played Overwatch, I think I actually played the demo when Overwatch 1 came out for like a, you know, you know 20 minutes or whatever. I was like, I suck at this. But um, I, I, I kind of 
only had any interest in Overwatch 2 because I played with Dreads and Murps on his stream. It's a lot more fun to play with them because Murps is... He was very nice and he was very supportive and he was like, Oh, follow me, Redbeard. We'll stand here and we're gonna shoot over there. Like, oh, okay. When I'm playing, like, I don't know where I'm going half the time. And I, what I found was playing with ra random people in like a random queue. I, I started following people and then I'm like, well, am, I, am I going where I need to go? I'm following Murps because he was taking me where I needed to go. But I, I, it's better when I'm with other people because then they're not, I'm not, I'm always getting shot like four on one anyway. But I was like, oh, it's good to play with Murps. I like that. So I don't think I have a ton. But, but the thing is, like, when I play with them, I don't want to be so absolutely inept. So it's like, why? Well, okay, I can get a little better playing without them, maybe. But then I'm not having as much fun, so it's kind of like a catch. And no matter how good I get, Dreads is still going to blame everyone else and say that we suck, even though he, I got more kills than him in my first game. I was just kind of like spinning in a circle, firing, you know? It, not just in the game, but in my computer chair. I thought I was getting attacked in real life. I didn't know how the game worked. Uh, that card's not even that good, huh? Any tips to get past three wins? I haven't gotten that in a couple of months. I'm not really good at it. I would say make sure you're running something like Hearth Arena that can help you with your draft and make sure you're running something like Hearthstone Deck Tracker, which can help you um, see what's left in your deck. And uh, if you're not doing those things, that will probably help you improve incrementally, like right away. Mm, I think I don't mind squeezing off the heal. If you're already doing that, I would say um, check the HS replay data for, for win rates for cards, so you can have a better idea of like how to value cards in addition to those tools, let's say make sure you're drafting a strong curve. So make sure you're getting enough twos and threes. And then just broad suggestions or, or, or tips for getting better at Hearthstone in general. Battlegrounds, Standard, Arena, probably Mercenaries, but I don't really know how to play that game. Is make sure you're spending all your mana every turn. If you're not sure what to do, try to spend all your mana and it's probably going to be a good bet that uh, you're making the the quote unquote right play. So like, this is a terrible example because I don't want a Shavara because I have the board, but what we're gonna do is spend the four and get a heal off. So we're still gaining some, like we're gaining value from this mana we spent. We're preventing him from being able to ping. We're keeping an extra minion, but uh, like on turn one, we played a one mana two five. On turn two, we played a two mana, whatever, three five. And uh, that sort of being able to play cards every turn that will sort of lead to these kind of like that snowball-y type feel. Like, oh, I don't know why I'm so far behind. Well, it's because your opponent played something on one and then played something on two and then played something on three. And your first play came on three, so you're already three mana behind. Or your first play came on four and you're already six mana behind. So just think what a six mana card can do, and you just didn't get to do that. Use Arena Tracker, not Hearth Arena. Use either one. If you're not using either one, then uh, you're in trouble. If that's objection, I'm fucking annoyed. What if it's not objection? That tone of voice. You love my new recipe. Redbeard. Who's Hearth Arena Tracker? Not Hearth Arena. <laughs> A smidge of this? I just read, you know, I just read them. Didn't mean to come off like that. <laughs> Hello, what's up, Eternity? How are you, man? Thanks for the follow. I'm just kidding around. I just read them, though, you know? Watching streamers and their YouTube helps you improve, especially subscribing to Redbeard's YouTube. And actually, I do think, jokes aside, that that is a, a good way to get better because you're going to see the good decks. You're going to see the good decks that perform well and um, you're going... That stuff's good, right? Really? That's what we're taking? Ooh. Yes, that's the one. Whoa, that's a lot of shit I can put on the board. Hopefully he has some class cards. The last guy didn't. 
<laughs> this is actually good to get eight copies of. It's actually pretty good. Oh man. Got some beard hair in my mouth, sorry. I mean, I got three of them. They're pretty good though. Don't worry, Red reads my messages if I'm a Karen. I don't read my messages. I, mean, I don't do that. I thought your name was Karen. So bad. Okay, I got it. Side effects? No. I still have to pee. Oh my god, I've got to pee. Um, I'm actually not sure what to do here. I could do that or this. I guess this is a full clear. What's in his hand? Some crap. This puts more pressure on the board. Makes us. Okay, let's just get a better trade, maybe. Ship gets worse as we get ahead. Shivara, yeah. Yeah, like if you get this down. Did we know that he had that? I can't remember. We play mine. Hmm. That was, wasn't that what we got from his deck? Oh, he just topped it. That was the one he, he drew, right? Um, I guess I can just do this. Huh? Okay, so what do we want to draw? Something good? Really, I don't really care what I draw. If I'm making requests. I'd rather he just draw crap, because I, I don't I don't think we really need anything right now. Except we need him to um Oh, is that his snap freeze still? I don't think I would have even used that. Hmm. Don't really want to silence that. All right, let's put that there. I'll hold it. I don't love it. We're getting sensual on stream, you and I. Not on this website. Bone Jewelry is ready. I hate this game. Oh, how I hate this game. Also, I probably should have silenced that. I forgot what that card did. Looking like a freaking piece of macaroni and cheese. Dude, all of this is dookie, man. That stupid card. Alright, let's play this. Am I going down to No, oh, you know what? Actually, this is pretty good. Sure. Wish I had another one of those on the board. I guess it wouldn't be pushing as much damage, huh? Maybe it kind of worked out better. Because we get to end the game this turn. Okay, it's pee time, alright. I'll drink this last sip of water before I go. Because... This is coming out right now, right? That's how it works. I think it just shoots right out. Where did the uh, Eternal Man go? <laughs> uh, you say something bad? Uh-oh. First person on my stream gets a sub. Oh yeah, don't do that. Give me a sub. Give me a sub. That would be better. <laughs> We don't want a V Eternity sub, we want Redbeard subs. He's at bad manners. I gotta pee. Speaking of bad manners, I think I can make it back. Zyrella versus Kael'thar! It seems my work is not finished. For the light, for my daughter! So I went to eat two potato chips too. Oh my god. Mm, not a bad hand. It was freezing all of a sudden. It wasn't cold. The hell? If your first message you send is hi, come to my stream and I'll pay you. That's pretty low. 
You know, there have been worse first messages. Short. But for the roast, my lord. it was just dreads and we made the mistake of not banning him, so this is for the best. First thing dreads did. The first message he ever sent here was criticizing me for not being a good streamer. He was absolutely right. I like this skin. The culprit was not I could play that. Redbeard, what was my first message? I bet it was something polite or lame. Yeah. You were asking for breakfast burrito. Please, streamer. Please play Yoshi's Lounge. <sighs> now you come in and demand big Yoshi's Lounge. Then you get what you want as a result. Oh, I'm missing. I mean, Yoshi's Lounge is a treat for all. Hi, Tasney. Want to make out in Minecraft? Ooh. Right, is that a YouTube video? Is that like a thing? That should be. Making out in Minecraft. <laughs> Minecraft kissing my girlfriend in front of other girls. I'm just fast boarding, I don't really know how to... Oh, maybe the most played part? Wanna play that? Yeah, I guess the taunt's okay. Oh. I don't really care if he's pinging this. Okay, hold on. Let me just give the thumbs up. Gotta support my uh, fellow YouTube creators. The first message was something about dancing. Sans shirt, it was. Said, hey, can you take it off and wiggle a little bit, Mr. Streamer? I, I said yes. <laughs> Why is the cat so green? It's a Halloween uh, version. You like him? <laughs> Honestly, uh, this is better for explosive and it's better for objection, huh? Funny. Uh, we want to hit here. We want to hit here. We want to roll. Here. Link is the best Halloween out emote. Oh yeah, Dreads Toad. My first message was, how do I close this browser tab? <laughs> yeah, you are old. <laughs> you are old. Don't know how to use a damn computer. Like us boomers. These baby boomers, they need uh... a... <laughs> They need, uh, they need help. Wish that one didn't come out. Hmm. I wonder that one troublesome. How many have died? Three? I need three to die? He's killing one? No. He's not killing one. He is killing one. I can run it in. I could run it in. And then I could shoot him? Hmm. I can run it in. And then I can run it in. Oh man, Vengeful Visage is so bad for us because he has the Conjurers. <sighs> I mean, what am I supposed to do? I probably, you know, I guess I could shoot that one if that's what it is, huh? I guess I could shoot it. That would be a not so bad, huh? Alright. Yeah, Big Yoshi's Lounge is a really nice tune. I enjoy listening to it. It's growing on me. The links work now, Abumi. Are you gonna download uh, Raid Shadow Legends? Remember, we're gonna do something special. I don't know what. Whatever you guys want. Name your price. If we get to 85. We're almost at 20. So, yeah. Let's go. Um, okay. Mm. He's got a Conjurer. There's just nothing I can do about it. If he doesn't get any taunts, that could be cool. That's not good for Fire me. Consume you. Hmm. Yeah. Not good for me. I'm bringing the party. 
Yeah, this could have gone better for me, noble Redbeard. Um, we've got Murazond. Maybe he casts a burn spell, like fireballs a minion. We draw Murazond, and oh golly gee, Willikers. We draw Hudonculus. Juicy. Speaking of Juicy Dongulus. Thank you, Juicy, for the 5,000 bits. My god, Juicy. What the heck is going on? Can I use those suggestions if I'm on mobile? Yeah, most of them. Yeah. Maybe some of them external tools. I'm not sure if they do work, but... It's been a while. I've missed you, my sweet friend. Thank you for the 5,000 bits. I was in San Diego for a while. Have you been here since I got back? Maybe one day? I feel like I might have seen you once since then. That wasn't that long ago. I was thinking this time last year. I guess I was asleep in the hotel. Uh, this was the night Dexter. Last week, Friday, Dexter and I were hanging out till like midnight, maybe? Midnight, 1230? And then I went straight to bed. Better things are up ahead. One day you will visit America, maybe. America is a wonderful place full of opportunity and criminals some places. I'm surviving. Surviving is good. Surviving is like 99% the battle. Because once you lose that battle, you'll lose the war. What time is it for me? Uh, 1.45 a.m. Juicy! Hey! I did know Kyochula Tazni was here. Thank you for the 1,000 bits, Juice Meister. I don't know what I did to deserve a guy like you, but I sure as heck gonna try to do it twice. Don't go to California. I like California. I lived there for 33 years. I'm so happy Juicy is here. Me too. Such a sweet boy. I hope he evolves and then evolves into a 2 mana 1-1. One, one. That'll help me out a very, very small amount. Actually, kind of a lot, probably, huh? Three hours ahead. Should have figured. Where are you at? Ooh. Ooh la la. I mean, I want the kill. The good thing about, or, or what you kind of want to do is clear as many minions off of muck pools. That wasn't a good one to get. And it was pretty cheap, but sometimes you just have nothing to evolve, right? And that's pretty good. Virginia, ah, uh, okay. I have some extended family in Virginia that I haven't seen since I was a little baby. California had to ban Redbeard. Where'd that go? Because of the new emission <laughs> caps. What's funny is uh, Oregon, the air is so much fresher, it's so much cleaner. It rains a lot, there's less people. It's less smog. Well, I mean, there's like no smog and whatnot. And uh, California actually has very strict emission standards for cars now. As a result of not having any standards for a long, long time and Winners creating one of the smoggiest the places in the human fall. existence. But uh, there's a lot of times there's old trucks that people drive around here coughing up like black smoke and I'm like <laughs> I'm like walking and riding my bike <laughs> and I think oh well, I guess they don't care they should probably have the similar standards but they don't I remember talking to people who are from Oregon around the area I'm like hey what's the deal with these cars billowing out black smoke and they're like oh is that not normal I'm like no dude this is bad for the environment what the hell can't be doing that California, you have to pass a smog tech check every, what, two years or something? Some crap like that? It's really freaking annoying, but still, you had to do it. You didn't have a choice. I have trained for days. She's great. Makes me sad. It took me so long to get here. I should have powered through the sad and be happy for this glorious moment. Never powered through the sad. Never change juicy or wonderful it's okay to be sad you might have caught the tail end of one of dreads streams in which case it can take upwards of three or four days to even recover from something like that we will hold the black temple uh let's kill this one the force of his back hair is a sight to see 
How much does it cost for a full guided tour? <laughs> well, the biggest expense is uh, the shrink ray to get small enough to traverse over there. Better write this down. But uh, other than that, I don't think it's too expensive. Sounds heavy. Oh, it is. Oh, it's heavy. All right. I love Murazon. I love the attack sound that Murazon makes. I also didn't realize they played the coin. So if I had had a play there, I would have missed it. I forgot they played the coin. Hey, Koto, what's up, dude? How are you, Mr. Koto? Mostly just feeling the vibes, hell yeah. It's a good vibe kind of night, I think. Doing stuff, saying stuff. I actually shed a tear. Okay, someone smacked me or spanked me. Wait, why? This isn't Dreads' fault, is it? <laughs> I was only kidding, he's a sweet boy. Um, you ain't gotta watch a stream. Crying can be okay. I don't cry a lot. Sometimes I wish I did cry more. Maybe I'll watch a dog video. I usually cry when I watch the dog videos. Like it's like, you know, somebody's like not friends with a dog or something. Excuse me. Because the dog is so good at Hearthstone. <laughs> I actually like watching dog. I think, I think he knows who I am. I don't think he really cares. But I like him. I find him to be an entertaining dude. I saw you play Raid yesterday. Yeah, we're still doing a promotion for those of you who want to support. Good looking out, Koto. Um, I like Raid. It's not a game that I have played every day for five straight years. That's cool. You pop in, you level up the guys, kill some trolls, upgrade some gear. It's always there for you. I still have Ninja. I'm working on getting one- I'm getting ninja to six stars, I don't know if you heard. I miss dog ladder streams. Yeah, I prefer to watch dog play- well, I don't mind- I, I like Battlegrounds, I like- I like watching Constructed, actually. I think they're both fun. Knows who you are? Doesn't care? Could describe a lot of people? Yeah, but five, four, five years ago, Refugee, nobody knew who I was. Nobody. And they also didn't care. <laughs> Those who did, the much fewer number didn't care. So, you know, this is a better alternative, even if it's not like, you know, the best life or whatever. Arena looks weird with their board. For a second I thought we were playing Battlegrounds. I did too, huh? I was thinking the same thing. That looks like a Battlegrounds board. You must protect Red from crying at all costs. What if um, I just cry because of... Sometimes I cry because, like, you know, the beauty of life. I'm playing against Zack. That's me. I'm Zack. Juicy as Zack as well, daughter. I believe. Oh, my daughter. Shut up. If I pick up another two, then I can coin those out. I could always get the beetle down at some point. Uh, we got I Laz. Thank you, I Laz, for the follow. Okay. Hey, they actually let me download the thing I need to download this time. Great. Great. Just spectacular. Um, yeah. What does this do? A 1 1 copy? Yeah, sure. Sorry. Right. Are there any mercenary streamers? We actually got raided by a mercenary streamer once. And then. I think I maybe even raided them back, and I don't remember who, exactly who they were. I, haven't, I didn't see them after that much. But this was not like a day after mercenaries came out. It was like six months, maybe? I don't know. It was a while. A year? I don't, I don't know how long that game's been out. gone poorly for me to start you to get say the, the least it was better to play these you two. get the goods i'll stand watch maybe it was dog saving videos by the dodo yeah the dodo the dodo makes me cry oh don't give him anything good uh, yeah. it's good if he's evolving 
for him. The what? The Dodo is a YouTube channel? I think they just collect, um... Is that worth it? I think they just collect, um... I don't really love it, huh? Let's play this and this, um... I guess we'll kill someone's one of these, coming, like, existing videos. I don't think they, like, make them. Maybe they do. People, like, send in their videos to the Dodo or some. Shoot. Well, he could get a six mana, like, 2-2 or some crap like that, right? You are unfit to serve. You are unfit to serve. Shut up. Shut up. I'm unfit for a lot of things, but you ain't gotta talk about it, Sylvanas. I'm getting fit starting later. Shavara doesn't look that good, huh? Pick up a Skeletal Dragon. I hate this game so much. Why did they give me crap? Dude, this is like... Why did I take these cards? Um, I didn't know what I'm doing here. The curate videos of animals being rescued. Yeah, yeah, that sounds about right. What a day. Sounds like it's an angle soft, angel soft, to watch it. If if animals move you, then yeah, it could be dangerous to watch the dodo. But it's you know it's also it's nice to. Because a lot of times the animals are like not doing so good and then they bring them back to full health and then they give them like a, oh I'm gonna cry right now. They give them a nice house to live in. That's cool. I like that. I, I do like that. Oh, I should think I was thinking about one. But my eyes broke. I don't know what's happening. I don't know what's happening. Right. Oh wait, I can kill that. Should I kill that? What did he play? Oh frick, dude. Oh, did he play another one? Okay, I don't need that. Trade, trade. I'll kill the big one. He gets more mana, but honestly, it's it's a better evolved target for him anyway. Uh, he can kill this. Right now, he can't kill this, in theory, but this card is so much more important, I think. Because if I pick up Identity Theft and get like four cards, that could be huge. An angle, Angel, it's the same thing. Oh, yeah, sorry, I wasn't sure. I was trying to figure it out sometimes on the fly, sorry. Some sweetheart Pitbull, it's so skinny you can see their ribs all scabbed up and she's got puppies. Not always that, is it? Sometimes though, so, maybe. Wait, that was his turn? God, that was such fart. Did this one just get the buff? I oh no, it didn't. Oh, this is great. I just do this. I do this. None can hide from the light. And then what I'm gonna do is just summon a five-five. And I'll take the free trade. There's a four mana five-five. That's a pretty sweet deal. I don't know without googling it. Angle, angel, angel. I could get that one right. Probably from playing Magic the Gathering for 25 years. Lots of angels. Lots of little angels in this chat too though. I'm juicy and you're one of them. You think this is your time? It is not an Stop lying! Stop lying! That's what should it be. Sarah Angel. Oh, I had a Sarah Angel. Which other one? There was a... Uh... Blinding Angel? Was that one from like masks or something? Or, or one of them sets around there? Apocalypse? It was a pretty sick angel back when I was a kid. When I was playing a ton of magic online, one of the core sets had an angel that had, I think it had lifelink. And when it hit the opponent, it would put a plus one plus one counter on your whole board. That was like the bomb of the bomb for a uh, limited. It was like the best thing you can get pretty much. Slayer? Oh yeah, that's the five mana five five first strike. Flying. Does it have haste? Protection from like demons and dragons, or what? Some of them had protection from like red and use two. Um, I don't have to infuse, right? Just hmm. three or less. Then I double trade and then I kill him. Three or less. 
Uh, let's hit here just in case. Let's hit here. It does sound sick. Which one? What was it called? Somebody probably knows. It was like a 5 mana 2 4 or a 5 mana 3 5? Uh, it feels. Tell me your favorite card interactions. Uh, in Hearthstone? Um, Elise shuffling a pack into your deck. Uh, Faldori Strider shuffling a pack into your deck. Uh, Rin deleting someone's entire deck. Rafam turning your whole deck into legendaries. Like Elise and Rin. Best MTG Angels. Oh, this is the one. Archangel of Thune, that was it. For 5 mana 3 4 flying lifelink. Wow, that's a that's great flavor text. 5 mana 3 4 flying lifelink. Whenever you oh it's whenever you gain life, put a plus one plus one counter each color control creature each creature you control. So it didn't have to hit them. And you could have other sources of lifelink buff your board. And it buffs itself. But the flavor text for this Archangel of Thune is even the wicked have nightmares. Cool. So like, the ghouls are afraid of her. That's neat. I like that. Alright, let's see. What else do they say? I don't... I just need pictures of the cards. Oh, there they are. Ooh, Linvala was an angel. I remember Linvala. Platinum angel. Sick. What else we got? Emiria the Shepherd. I don't remember. Oh, that's Landfall? Is that from the second time one of those sets came back? 7 mana 4-4. Four, four. Whenever a land enters the battlefield, you may return a non-land permanent from your graveyard to your hand. If it's a plains, it can hit the battlefield. Cool. Avacyn, Angel of Hope. 5 mana 8-8. Eight, eight. Flying, Vigilance, Indestructible. Other permanents you control have Indestructible. Alright, that's cheating, man. You can't do that. You, uh, you can't do that. Uh, Gisela, Blade of Gold Knight. Okay, I don't, I don't know what that is. Seven mana, five, five, flying for a strike. If a sorcerer deals damage to an opponent or permanent opponent controls, it deals double. If a sorcerer deals damage to you, it's halved. Okay, yeah, it's got a... Sure. Arulia, the War Leader. I remember this one. Six mana, three, four. Flying Vigilance Haste. When it, enter, when it attacks, untap all your creatures and you get to attack again. What the flip? What the flip and skip? All right, I want this guy off the board. I want him to stop drawing cards. Lyra Dawnbringer. Five mana, five, five, flying, first strike, lifelink. Other angels get plus one, plus one, and have lifelink. Hmm. Never seen, I haven't seen half these cards. This is a Mardu angel, four colors. Two, two, flyer. When it attacks an opponent, you put an angel, a demon, or a dragon from your hand onto the battlefield, tap then attacking. Wow, that's pretty cool if you're attacking with that. And then, I don't know what this is, Atraxa, the Praetor's, vo Praetor's Voice, four mana, one green, one blue. Nobody knows what I'm even talking about, that's okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, I could do this. I don't want to just do this. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Mm -hmm. yeah, I don't know. One blue, one green, one, one white, and one black. Four mana, four, four, flying vigilance, lifelink, death touch. At the end of beginning of your end of step step proliferate. Uh, I like cards that proliferate. Those are cool. Oh, anyway, sorry. Avatar. Oh yeah, I remember the avatars. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry. Oh, that hurt. Sneezing should hurt, right? My compliments. Yeah, Avatar of Woe. I think was one of the, like the Mac Daddy um, limited cards. I really hated James Cameron's Avatar when I saw, and I vowed to never see it again. I liked it. I don't remember it, but I remember liking it. It was just Gone with the Wolves or something, right? Captured by the Wolves. What was the movie called? Gone with the Wind? <laughs> Captured by Wolves. It's a different movie, I think. Do you know that Nerubian Egg is very good? We've got two Blessing of Kings and two Spike Ridge Steeds. Is Nerubian Egg in the meta? Uh, but yeah, I like the eggs. I think in a Warlock deck or a Paladin deck, the eggs can be good, for sure. Let's see where this goes. Hmm. I brought in 
Okay, I'm okay with this. A little uh, risky, but we get the Shivara down. It's hard to find a time to get Shivara. Like if you're playing the Nova, just gonna have a big, uh, healthy, nasty boy. Kind of gonna be making a similar Shivara play, I think. If you don't take it this turn, you're gonna kind of be forced to probably try a play like that anyway. Nova here? Nova down to four. Kind of garbage. I won't lose that. Uh, uh, I'm just gonna do this. Down to four. I'm gonna cash in the Shivara. And honestly, you know what? Fuck it. We're pumping some damage. We're healing our guy. It's fine. Yeah, Slithers. I had a Slither... Slither Queen? Slither Queen? I had a Slither deck when I was a kid. I'm bringing back so many Commander memories. Uh, yeah, I think a lot of those were Commander cards, huh? Slithers were cool. They were never really my favorite. They were cool, though. Hey, they were alright. Guess I'm playing this? I guess I'm gonna Nova as well. Maybe not. You know what? I should've bumped first. That was a mistake. Um... Okay, new plan. You get the cool. Like, sit around doing nothing for a while. I like it. I like it. You get the Remember that Autogs? Remember? Which was the really good one? Psychotog was like like the standard deck for its time, right? Psychotog? This card was insane, and like most of the Autogs were absolute trash. They all had like two abilities, right? And they kind of overlapped. Some of them had like half of one. They're all garbage. I think one, two, I think two were like okay. And the black, the black blue one was like, and it's magic sort of got a, a, a history of that, right? Just littered with cycles with just garbage. And then one colors is just like so overtly broken it could discard a card to get plus one plus one and then it could you could exile two cards from your graveyard to give it another plus one plus one or something right something like that so you could just make it like 20 20 in one turn or whatever i bought two boxes of masters so i could open emrakul and kozilek i have ulamog Ulata, uh, uh, uh a togs with upheaval, upheaval. Yeah, that was cool. I didn't play a lot of standard. I've always been a limited card player, but I remember these cards. Yeah, that deck looked like giga poo. Props to them for getting to four with a deck that's running Terror Guard, Iron Beak, Flight Master, Guild Recruiter, Hungry Etten. They didn't play one spell and they didn't play one good minion. <laughs> Played a couple maybe average minions. They, they may have drafted a stinker. They may have taken a stinker to four. Commendable in a, in, a, in a way. Keep all this? I don't know. Maybe I ditch one of those threes. I probably should have ditched like Courier. Tried to find another two. Or a better card. Like even trading this for like a, a Marazond would probably be okay. Mm. I have Ulamog. They may have Kaka in their undies. I hope not. I think that's a serious medical condition. Do I want to hold my um, coin? Maybe. I mean, if he's throwing his guy and hero powering and then not playing a forensic duster, then good. If he's stuck leaving this up because he wants to play a forensic duster, then we can coin out a taunt. Oh, that'll never work. It did work, but that's okay. Um, play that. You play this, but he can just hero power it. But again, I'm not really opposed to him investing mana, hero powering on turn two or three or four. The culprit. Hey, there's the duster. Who would it? Who would have guessed? Other than Redbeard, of course. My shield, Port Argon. Hmm. He bumps there, and he can still hero power, and he gets to trade. Yuck. That's okay, we have to clean the scene. We can taunt so we're not taking, like, infinity damage right now. Uh, that's pretty good, but if I play it, I am going to take infinity damage. At least seven. Interesting. 
Kaelin pulls that red herring. I think I actually just take the Drake. We just keep kind of stacking. Um, this one good? Yeah, let's play this one. Uh, we keep stacking AoE. And then maybe we can just, he'll run out of value. Sometimes some decks run out of value. What time is it? 2 a.m.? Is it time to play the clean the scene? No, it is not. It is time to top deck Holy Nova and save the clean the scene. Hmm. Hmm. I play nothing. It's a little suspicious. We can see if we get a Murazond. Let's see if he plays in to clean the scene. Come under my it's a lot better with five attack. Yeah, trade. Oh yes, that's great. Okay, we'll clean them. I'll get the three four down. We only have the identity theft. So one in eighteen. Beast. Do I want a Bog Beast? Maybe. Bog Beast plus nothing. You know what it makes me think? Is that a uh, Stoneborn General's coming down next the turn? Is this way. Hmm. A mistake, but not the end. Could have gone better for me. I'm glad I didn't throw the seven down. Hey Marvin, how are you? Have a nice weekend. Are you leaving or are you here? Either way, thanks for being here, man. Wild. Uh, I think you would play a Stoneborn General if you had one there, right? We will hold the Black Temple. I'm coming. Oh, okay. Well, thanks for being here. Thanks for checking out the YouTube. Thanks for visiting Raid Shadow Legends. You cannot break the bro. A little healing. Okay, what's he playing? Kaka, Kaka, and more Kaka, which is great. I could go for some quadruple Kaka. You think this is your time? It is I dare you. You possess true. Red, if having shitty underpants was a major medical, I would be using a protracted guest. I would be doing a protracted guest starring role on Grey's Anatomy. <laughs> Yuck. Do you have a YouTube? We do have a YouTube. <laughs> Rep, you geeky little scammer. How's today's video doing? Not as well as yesterday's. How unplayable is Rogue? Huh. Maybe we could go with. Unplayable, but not unwatchable. Oh, what a nice message. That's right. Well, maybe, you know, maybe people just, you know, maybe this is Friday night. They're out with their, their sweetie pies. Pretty much everything dies. But not everything dies. Oh, we just, it doesn't, it doesn't really matter what we do, I don't think. I don't know, it'll just tag him. None of this really matters. Um, How are we doing with subscribers? I feel like the subscribers thing is going up again. We can start always a little slower. Are they? How do the, um, how does the YouTube do with old videos, I wonder? I never really check. What's our total view count at? Wow, we got 115 subscribers in the last 28 days. That's pretty good. I hope we can get like 130 or something. How do you see the analytics, views, all time? Uh, 8, 13, 14. 
863,000 views. Wow, that's crazy. 863,000 views on YouTube on one video. Just imagine that. That would be better. Subs are going great since the new format. One stat that is not doing too well is the amount of people that have notifications on. So you need to beg some more for that. Okay, turn on notifications, um, Media Marvin. <laughs> ding the bell. Come on, ring the goddamn bell, Imoniaki, please. <laughs> I'm begging you. My boss told me. He he told me I couldn't ask. I must beg. Zyrella versus Gul'dan. Man, so many good runs lately, huh? That's delightful. For the light. Implying they don't have notifications for on for your new videos already, Mr. Streamer? I am. Refugee Geek just said, and I quote, not a single person, especially Imoniaki, has them turned on. And if he says he does and he's a lying pile of excrement. Howdy Red, how's the night trading? You're pretty good. We had a 10 and a 6. We opened a couple of Pokemon packs. We have a couple more. We got a huge raid from Asmodai and Taze TV. Two huge raids. A couple people downloaded raid, but I don't know if we're gonna hit that 85, but somebody got to level 25. So they'll get a t-shirt, and Red will get a little boosty boost to his bank account. I have trained for days. Uh, don't forget the juice man came in here and buried us in support today, which is kind of absurd. I'm gonna win. I'm level 100 on raid. Are you really? I'm proud of you. Accusing me of lying? No, I'm just kidding. You would never lie. You're not dreads. I have trained. A 1-1 one, one copy of this card is actually a 3-1. Three, a 3-mana, three 3-1 three, taunt. Give oh, a 2-mana, 3-1 three, taunt. Give a minion plus 2 plus 2. How good would that be? That would be just like the best card ever printed if that's what it, you know, if that card existed. We're around 3 to 4% and YouTube says around 20% is typical. Really? Hmm. Well, that's good info. How do you uh, get people to, to listen? How do, you, how do you get people to listen when you're begging? Double trade and get the five down. I kind of don't want to lose the two one right now. Let's just wait. Three to four percent. Let's say four. To, let's just say four. Come on. I don't have the bell hit. Should I hit the bell? <laughs> I get notifications. Maybe I do have the bell hit. I get notifications. I like all the videos. I comment on the comments. Everybody Keeps lying. Nobody has notifications on for new videos. I don't have them on for anyone except Redbeard. True. It's true. Now you're telling the truth. Now you've told the truth. Told the truth. hold out because I have this now. If I didn't draw probably one of these on this specific turn, I probably would have just cashed it in now. A heal's certainly not. What the fuck? <laughs> there's no way. I mean, there's a way, but what the fuck is going on there? That was a six mana. 3-3. <laughs> three, three. Must have a couple of Denathrius's in his hand. 10% seems higher than I expected, but what do I know? I, I had no idea. I really had no indication for what uh, what was what. Sure. It cannot be done. Only have notifications on for Redbeard's only fans. Smart. The dong is out. I repeat, the dong. The dong signals in the sky. The pasty white ass uh, is 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 somewhere as well. Lest we forget. Out of my um. What, what, did I, what was I offered? Was that three things that died to his five five? What did I? God dang it! 
There is a picture of my raid. It looks unbelievable. That's crazy to me that he uh he did it like this. Three, four, five, six, seven, three, four, five. Six, seven. Does dingo. It's 10 to 30 to have notifications on for channel. 5 to 20 to have YouTube notifications enabled in general. Gotcha. Fascinating. Very, very interesting. Bad. Man, their deck doesn't look that good either. I think we're getting lucky again. No Scrap Imps. No Evil Geniuses. Uh, we went first. And we got so far ahead that the Abyssal, which is one of his best cards, didn't do anything. I think for Raid, three years now. I've been max level for over a year. You should start a whole new account. Lethal two turns ago? No, Nova doesn't go face anymore. Um, it only hits minions. I want to refill my water. Zyrella versus Uther. I will bring order. For the light. For my daughter. Mm. Wasn't that change made four years ago? <sighs> Probably two and a half. I think we got the core set. I think it was right around then, but I, I may not be, you will be a worthy foe. accurate in that. It cannot be done. I'm gonna play this one. If he does something where I want to play these, then we can. If he just hero powers, then I can play this. I think uh, I was thinking about that. I, I find it somewhat fascinating that um, that the change can be that old. And I'm not. I'm. This may sound like I'm starting out, re getting ready to diss that gentleman. That's not the, my intention. That that the change could have been made so long ago, and people still kind of remember Nova as this five mana two damage finisher in a lot of arena games or Hearthstone games or whatever. I actually think it's kind of cool that Hearthstone was as popular as it was and people sort of um, still recall like these you know, certain cards or certain effects or like these very common situations are still sort of like ingrained in people's brains. Go for it. No, 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 I know I wasn't. I, I actually think it's interesting. Like Hearthstone was such a popular game and certain um, like outcomes or scenarios were so common that uh, you get the cool. it's just like you, you've seen it a thousand times or more, depending on how much you played or how much you watched. You get the cool. You're always like, oh yeah, no, but two damage, win the game. A lot of games ended that way in Arena. And if you haven't been playing Arena, in a couple years or watching arena then you don't know that change has been made and so you know like in reference to how long ago that was now that it's been different the people still kind of have like a um you know, a memory for that that time free chat roast i'm not roasting the guy at least I, i'm not trying to someone's coming someone's coming oh baby 20 raid downloaders. Dude, if we're getting 10 a night, we could get there. Media Marvin. Thank you so much, Marv. We could get to the 85. That would be super sick. I will buy a rare Pokemon card if we get to 85 for myself. And I will do something for Twitch chat. I don't know what. I was just hoping we get one. Hi, it's me, RepuGeek. I'm going on my 19th vacation this year. <laughs> I'm old. <laughs> Got him. Reporting for duty. 
She texted me on Discord and I was like, I'm going on vacation again. I need a vacation. <laughs> okay. You earned it. Sort of. Someone's coming. Someone's coming. Trevor really hated this this thing. This art feels terrible. I just realized I don't really like this at all. Um What light? Like, you can barely even tell that there's two creatures in this. So she's like boosting the other one up through a window or something. I thought it was like a bug crawling on her, or like she had like a long ponytail or something. I didn't even know what the fuck was going on in this. I thought like a big dragonfly was landing on her shoulder or something. They don't look similar at all, but they're identical copies. Oh, horrible, horrible flavor. <laughs> Fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, eighteen. Um, it's funny. I could trade it and get his guy. <laughs> it was like her hair. Yeah, I just noticed that horrible flavor on the art. Not that the drawing is bad, but it's, it doesn't really convey what the card's doing very well. Like Shavar is cool. It's just like got six arms, got swords in his arms, deal six damage. Okay, I get it. He probably has a ten drop in hand. Maybe I could um just look for damage, but I really want to just get. I'm sure I'm gonna get it. I just have a feeling. You know what I mean? Someone's coming. I feel like I'm gonna get it. Steal this McGurgle Prime. It's better than winning the game, isn't it? What a sight! Truly, I need more mana. I need more mana. Someone's coming. Dance for me. Dance for me. Taunt face. Taunt face. What are those words you said? I imagine Rapid Geek has much. Has much a similar mind to George Martin. He created a monster as he evolved beyond his power. He used to desire to build a fantastic YouTube for Redbeard, but now he's famous, and all the hot babes want to go away to beaches with him. Would you ever? Would he, why would he ever do Redbeard videos again? <laughs> Refu Geek has the hot babes. Maybe. I hope so. Hope he finds, finds some nice partners or some, or has like some. I don't really know that much about him. <laughs> Great story though. Oh, uh, let's see. What can, what can we look up? What can I look at on the internet? Oh, sorry. Gotta look, uh, gotta get back to work. Do you call, call your partners partners? No. No, I don't do that. Good question though. For the light. For my Relevant. daughter. Topical. Dangerous. It's finally the weekend. Not for Redbeard, I gotta work all weekend. I asked the boss if I could take it off. My boss, Refugee, told me I had to get more runs done. <sighs> Despicable. Ooh, that's a good draw. Dude, I'm, the older I get, the more I'm looking like this goddamn homunculus, I noticed. Boss says no. Hey, Red, how you been doing? I'm good, Jerome. How are you doing, man? We had some great viewership. Thanks to Humongous Raid from Asmodai. Got some insane support. Thanks to Juicy McLovin Sauce himself, the legend, the legendary one. We uh, got a couple people to download Raid, complete the tutorial, which is cool. Probably ain't getting fired. We got Steve here typing gibberish in the chat. Always nice to see. What more can you ask? Or give him attack, wind fury, and taunt. Either got three good ones or three bad ones. So it would be bad. Health, divine shield, wind fury. Wow, he actually got crap. That's delightful. <laughs> give him a wow. We live in an age of one. Dude, you're crazy. You think you're getting both of them? Maybe he took maybe like took it over health or something. Smell like a <laughs> got the one man petting zoo. He's got the one man petting zoo over here. Uh you said what now? The exit is this way. I need another good draw. I'm thinking. 
I got you, friend. Six health. Clean the scene. No, I don't want clean the scene. Um. Out of my jungle. Take the airing. I'm gonna play this. I guess I'm just gonna cash this in too. And um, I suppose I'll kill this. I don't know. Duel Arena's almost there. That's the best moment of Arena. I um wish that wasn't out. Yeah, I hope we get dual class and I hope they don't saturate it with neutral shitters like we have right now. Hey Grammy Poo. It's not great for me. Wait, when do we get dual arena? They used to do it at the beginning of October. Like October, like second or third, the first probably Tuesday or whatever of October. And then they would run it for three weeks. So it would run till like the week before October. I'm um, sorry, Halloween. Um, and then last year was the first year they didn't do it with that cadence. And they started it at like, like November 3rd or something. Like, and it ran for I think like five weeks or something in December. It was like just all in all just weird and dumb and worse and bad and I was hating it. I wanted to play on Halloween. And then I was playing in, in I think December with a god dang Frankenstein body or something. I think the Shavar is gonna work. I would say definitely. 100%. You know, honestly, that could have been worse. Gosh dang it, I really want to crack that thing. 6, 13... Um, 4, 10 better? It actually is. If he doesn't kill it this turn, I could soak up a hit and then I can give it stealth, maybe. Handle it. And then soak up a hit. Hey, Graham! <laughs> Sorry, Graham, the damn thing's set to 100 bits. I can read it for you, though. Chat to spam no more neutrals. Chat to spam no more neutrals. <laughs> Let's see the chat to spam no more neutrals. Let's see the chat to spam no more neutrals. <laughs> no, nope, any good? Alright, I'm gonna hold because I need to hit Identity Theft and get like eight cards. I did 77 for luck, I'm sorry. Was my reading good though? I thought it was pretty good. Love Shadow Council when I'm the one playing it. Less so when they're the ones playing it. Red beard. Sometimes people ask me questions. Look at that, zoned. Oh, that's such fart, dude. People ask me questions. Beard. How are all of his minions so big? I'll tell you how. One mana give your hand plus eight plus eight and improve them all. Reading was flawless. Excellent German vocalizations. Isn't it Italian? I thought I was doing Italian. A legendary battle. A legendary battle. <laughs> It's for sure not German, I can tell you that much. Graham's out here committing fredophobia. Fredophobia. I just wanted him to know all my cards. Know that I'm running. Thank you. Such generosity. Such generosity. Um, I wanted him to know I was just rolling crap. Rolling crap out here. Cardusa. Thank you. Cardusa. 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 Hmm. Appreciate the follow. That's pretty cool. Why, why, Revy, why are you sending me this? It's making me feel bad about myself. Send me bad scores. Bad YouTube scores. Looks like my uh, Stanford 9 scores all over again. 
Hey Graham, I have uh, six Pokemon packs. I've been I've been saving them. I'm waiting for you. You excited or are you gonna be here in like five or ten minutes? Zyrella versus I hope so. Two two three. Get a skeletal dragon. Oh, it's happening. I'm excited. Yeah. Me too. I think they're gonna have really good things in them this time. <laughs> Sometimes they do. Uh, yeah, they had the new tins release, Graham. I don't know if you saw. I don't want to coin these out now. Give him card draw. He has nothing to do this turn. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um. And I swear I looked up a Poke Rev video in the store. I was like, oh, I wonder what's in them. And I swear he pulled out two Evolving Skies, two Lost Origins, and a Fusion Strike. I was like, all right, I'm in. They were buy two, get one free. I had a coupon. I paid almost, I, I mean, I paid some money, but I paid almost nothing. And uh, I opened them up and they had two Chilling Rain, one Fusion Strike, and two Lost Origins. New tins, yeah, new tins. Actually, I think... I don't think... I don't know where the promos are. I think they're sitting over there, and I forgot to put them in plastic, so they're probably all bent now. What's up, Koo? Hello. How are you, Mr. Koo? Uh, it's gonna be tough to beat this. But it's not gonna be tough to say thanks to my friend Koo, and that I'm happy you're here, and I hope you're doing well. That's FRC easy part, saying all them words. Let's do this. Yeah, there was, there was also a Deoxys box and like some other like electric Pokemon I wasn't familiar with. The new V-Star boxes came out. But there's only four packs in them and they're 30 bucks, man. They look cool, but I'm like, I don't even like those Pokemon that much. I can't remove anything right now. Nothing. Doesn't even kill that. What's my favorite Pokemon? I think I've decided, I decided Growlithe was my favorite. Growlithe was my favorite. But if I made a short list of my favorites, it would be Growlithe, Sylveon, Leafeon, and Glaceon, Charmander, and Squirtle, and Haunter, and... That's that's my that's the start of my short list. Get there three times, please, for the love of God. Oh, thank God. Uh, what's on here? He gets it back in his hand. Oshawott. I don't hate Oshawa. Oh, I like Totodile too. I've played more Heart Gold than any Pokemon game, but I did play the original Blue when it came out. Who else do I like? I mean, Gengar. Gengar's sick. But I always had Haunter because I didn't have the cord to trade with your friends. So I always had a Haunter, like level 100, and I never had a Gengar. Our Gold and Soul Silver remakes are so good. Yeah, they are. 16 badges. Think about that. 16 badges. If he starts popping off with Murlocs, I'm gonna lose it. I'll also be kind of impressed and kind of happy for him a little bit, you know? I like that Pokemon card you got that you didn't like very much. Uh, Noivern? Yeah, I don't, um, I, I don't dislike that card. I like that card actually a lot, and I like it more after getting it. I think Noivern's a cool card. Like the art's neato and whatnot. The thing that I don't like is, is twofold about that particular Noivern. One is I have two of them now. The odds of opening an alternate art are really, really low. I have two of that one. And then the secondary problem is the, the alt arts in that set, it's like, you can, I think you have an equivalent chance to get Noivern <laughs> or Sleeping Dragonite or any of the evolutions. So like, you've kind of gotten really, really lucky and you got a card that's worth like 20 or 30 bucks instead of one that's worth like 70 or 80 bucks. And I don't like Noivern as much as those other things. For the roast, my lord. Yeah, he's cool. I like him. I probably would have 
it's like there's a lot of Pokemon cards where it's like, oh, like I don't want to buy it. And then you open it and it's like, oh, this is really cool. That's why opening the new sets is more fun because you can kind of get anything and be like, oh, a full art of this, a trainer gallery of that card. I might never spend five bucks or ten bucks to buy the single, but now I can have it. Whereas if you're trying to get one specific card, even if it's not that rare, you might buy two or three boxes before you get like one specific trainer gallery card and they're only a couple bucks, you know? Yeah, I think he's cool. I I, I think, it's, it's a, my tertiary, is, is that a word? My, my third problem with that Noivern is I've never seen Noivern in a Pokemon game ever. If I didn't collect the cards, I wouldn't know that it existed. So it's like, I don't really care about that particular Pokemon. Can you show some of your past big hitters? Or are they not with an easy access? Oh, they're all here. I have a stack of them. I have a stack of them. I uh, feel pretty stoked the deck went eight. The last couple of games, we didn't hit Murazon. The deck kind of petered out there. I bought, um, eight's good. I mentioned that I hate Battlegrounds. Not today, but I agree. When you're losing Battlegrounds, it's really flippin' annoying. Um, I will show some Pokemon cards in a moment. Uh, we have a brief window where we can get near the max payout just to show another like 30 second trailer. So I think we're gonna do that real quick.